Okay, so before I start this video officially, let me say I am not a professional in these things. I'm only saying the things that work for me and how I understood it. So step one, which is like the most needed step, well, it's coming in third, learning how our body works. For just hearing it, it probably sounds, huh? But like, how long does it take you to digest food? What foods make you bloated? Um, how much water does it need to help you to stay hydrated? I mean, well, we already know that, but learning how our body works is a big, it has a big role to help make the journey a little easier. Step two. This step is the one that really messes people up because it could make you or break you. Finding the right workout. You know, some people, they want an hourglass shape. But they could do the wrong workouts and end up getting buffed with muscles and muscles and a lot of abs. So for step two, you really need to um, focus on the workouts that you do so you could get the right results that you're looking for. So please find workouts that are for you. Step three. So step three is practically a mixture between one and two. Because in one, we need to know how our body works. And step two, we need to find the workouts that are good for you. But in step three, we need foods. The foods that will give you the proper nutrients, depending on the type of workout and body shape that you want. Which will also come for step two. So like, the foods that you pick, let's say it bloats you. You need to find out what foods make you bloated and what foods help you to unbloat. Like, if it's hot water. And also, what workouts help you to unbloat. Like some people say squats help them. That's practically what step three is. I know you guys didn't understand, but step three is practically finding a way to make your workouts and the food you eat harmonize, like make them equal. So say you're eating this thing all the time, but you realize it makes you slower and sluggish during your workout. So, you know, some people will cut back on it. That's practically what I'm trying to say. Okay, so that category is practically how your body works. Now, this category is helping you see your results or seeing if your results are working. That's what this category is about. Okay, so this new category for step four will be dedication and self-control. Those are the most two important steps if you want your body, for me at least. Um, something I would always say is that I never starve myself. What I would do though, I would eat till I am full or at a certain point that I'm good enough and that I wouldn't have to eat another set of food. Starving yourself really wouldn't help you because your mind would be on food all the time and then when you finally get the food, you're going to want more because you missed it so much. So, uh, that comes in self-control. Do not starve yourself. Just eat the food. And if you know you're full but you're still hungry, just think about it. I hope that makes sense. I would also like to say that um, the dedication part, which I think that would be step five, that part comes in when you're doing your workouts. Me personally, I like to work out twice. That will be morning and dinner. If I do work out once a day, I would try to make the other day that I work out very intense, you know, just so I don't get a habit of not working out. I like to build a schedule so that my body gets accustomed to it. Um, having self-control and the dedication helps so you don't feel bad about yourself because sometimes I eat and like my body go and then the, my side is it's like, does it disappear? And then, you know, later when I work out and then I go on bed, I'm like, but I wasn't there. So that's why I like to keep a strict schedule. So it stays. Because, you know, sometimes it just, it could disappear anytime. Who knows? And I know that there are some days that you're going to feel like, oh my gosh, I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this. That's me all the time, every time I'm working out. Like, I swear, my workouts are supposed to be 15, end up being 5 minutes. But once you're putting in dedication to at least even do something, you're fine. Just do something. Um, another thing I would like to add, not really a step, just want to add a little more extra info out there. If the workouts you're doing and you feel you're not seeing any progress, it either means it's not intense enough or it's just not for you. And it's fine. 
there's other workouts out there and um, and one last thing i would like to say please do not feel guilty about eating food because why the hell would you feel guilty about eating something we need to survive you think you can survive oh right 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 the last step water water is actually very important in working out water helps you sometimes water can help you for staying bloated you know if you fall but you you still thinking about food go have some ice go have some water water helps you i think water helps clear your system that's just me you know those people who have those green mochas this also helps you but the thing i would say is to build a schedule and get your body accustomed to it if you feel like you don't want to do it either push yourself or don't do it and the next day do it harder punish yourself but water is actually pretty important And when you're waking up, please remember to breathe. When you're not breathing, it makes it very much harder. Sometimes you don't even know you're not breathing. And then you have to quit because you're out of air. Is it true? Is it? Eat or not? <laughs> breathe. Anyways, I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. I, like I said, I'm not a professional. This is just something that I did for myself and this is the analysis that i came up with for me not professional if i did say anything wrong you guys could instagram me or put in the comments i would reply if anyone's even watching the video but now the video is going to end there's going to be a bonus clip after this to show the workouts that i do and the videos that i watch Okay, so I decided to put the bonus clip as another video because this video is already long as is and no one likes a long video. So you guys can watch out for that. It will be dropping, if not today, tomorrow.